Friday, Slot Car News, sponsored by LEBHobbies.com. LEB Hobbies, racing fast, made easy. Visit LEBHobbies.com. Happy Friday, everybody. Uh, we're just doing this up in my dining room today, because why not? Um, we are starting off with some fly news. There's uh, two projects that they've been working on, evidently. There's a Hesketh, and then there's the updated uh, March that they worked on. The Hesketh uh, has a model of James Hunt, which is kind of cool, that they're going to be including uh, with the, uh, the next release of that. They just showed this on the uh, Facebook page today. And it's, it's neat to see uh, them take... Well, they've actually done uh, figures in the past with some cars... Uh, Rafael Barrios Sr., I believe, had been with a, uh, a Chevron years ago. And anyway, it's cool to see them do the, uh, the car with uh, the J little James Hunt figure. That really does, I think, uh, add to the value of the uh, buying the car, frankly. And the, uh, the new airbox on the March, I mean, that looks really good. The March is a really good driving car. Both of their, uh, or all of their F1 cars, their vintage Grand Prix cars, do run really, really well, and um, I'd encourage you to check them out. Anyway, on to some NSR news now. They're showing two liveries of the, uh, the Fiat 500 Abarth racing liveries of this car, car the Repsol liveries on this car. Uh, I I think these are pretty cool. <laughs> I own a Fiat, as you, you all probably know, a 500, not an Abarth, uh, just a sport edition and that's a it's a fun little odd car i really do enjoy it regardless <laughs> uh they're going to be releasing this car or these cars i should say pretty soon uh very cool stuff coming from them uh we we also got some avant news to talk about they are showing more uh liveries of the uh the six series bmw that they're going to be releasing this is uh the the old spirit mold on this car and uh, they've done a couple liveries on this car and it's nice to see more life in this mold because the 6 Series uh, it's a great car in real life it's one of my favorites it may be one of those that people are like eh well whatever but it's I, I think it's a really cool car really happy to see Avant doing more of these molds and there you go also they're showing their uh, their Mercedes hauler and F1 car. More detailed photos, I guess you'd say, of the uh, the the mold of the car. This is probably a resin cast mold, and boy, the photos really show off the detail well. Um, like I said before, I'm sure this is going to be a fairly spendy car, but you know, it's it's a it's a really detailed model. It's a hauler as well as what will be a pretty unique slot car. So, you know, I think you're either in the market for this or you're, frankly, just a tire kicker. I think it's an instant buy for some people or, yeah, it, it looks cool for others. Flyer also showing a new body, as they call it, for the 917 Longtail. I haven't compared it to the model of the, um, the 917 LH that I have. It does look... Uh, the body does look good. I do hope that if they are really redoing the whole body, that they would redo the part of the body that, frankly, a lot of uh, Porsche purists would like them to change, which is the headlights. The headlights on a 917, well, LH or the K, shouldn't be directly above one another. It should be offset a little bit, and that gives you a definitely a much wider look to the front of the car with the... the the headlights kind of not directly above one another, but kind of offset. And in any case, more 917s from Fly. It's it, it's a good thing regardless. <laughs> Let's just say that. I'll be back after this, folks, to wrap up the news.
Alrighty. Um, I will not be able to do a live stream this coming Sunday. Uh, the baseball team that I work for, um, it's kind of like a part-time job for me, but I really, uh, I love being the team photographer for the team. And um, they have a game on Sunday, first uh, Sunday afternoon game. Kids run the bases and uh, get nice pictures of kids uh, goofing around, <laughs> going like crazy around bases after the game. So it, it's a lot of fun for me to shoot. In any case, uh, I, I will do a live stream at some point uh, this coming week, during the week, just to catch back up with folks. And uh, I did want to make note that the, um, the car I've been talking about for quite a while now, the, uh, the slot at Chaparral, has started to ship, has started to already arrive uh, with people, the regular folks, the dealers are already shipping the car. So, you know, we don't really have to wait anymore. It's, it's, it's here. So enjoy. <laughs> anyway, folks, um, there you go. Thanks for showing up for the news. I really appreciate it. And uh, see you all again soon.